call yourself a pansexual if you've never deep throated a pan. Okay. I guess by that logic, I'm stepdad sexual. Hmm. Hey, no, man. Come on. <laughs> What's up guys and welcome back to MK. My name is Damien and today we're looking through r slash cursed comments. One, wait, whoa, whoa, wait. Woman banned from giving birth after having 44 kids. Whoa. First of all, impressive. Second of all, were you speed running? How do you have 44 children? What? Aren't water slides generally closed after too many accidents? Oh. <laughs> Yeah, normally, but that's a rare case, I guess. Hey, Toby on the telly! I love that guy! Imagine not knowing your crush's cat's name. It gets worse when you're apologizing for running it over. Hey, I'm sorry for running over your... Uh... uh, f uh snow... Uh, your cat. <laughs> <laughs> After a male ant inseminates the queen ant, it is murdered. Imagine the reward for finally getting laid being death. Uh, at this point... I'd take it. What would you do if you had a button, and every time you press it, you win $100,000, but one person dies? Well, of course I'd do the obvious thing and get an auto-clicker. I want that 100 Gs, baby. What's a level one enemy in real life? Babies. Uh, apparently farming them for XP is looked down on, though. Well, that's because it takes too long for a new one to spawn. You idiot, you dummy. Imagine waiting nine months just to grind XP. Not efficient. If my toaster burns everything at setting 4, then why does setting 9 exist and what would it do? It's for people who want to get really funky in the bathtub. Dude, I want to commit toaster bathtub. It's a forbidden bath bomb. Mm-hmm, exclusive, one-time use. You're in hell, but if you beat the devil in the game of your choice, he'll let you out. What game do you pick? The game to seduce me into a relationship. If the devil loses, get out of hell card. If the devil wins, then at least my time in hell will be more entertaining. Dude, that's just Stockholm Syndrome with extra steps. Yeah, maybe that's part of the game. Crashing Thanksgiving dinners. Hey Danny, I'm a big fan. Just turned 12 and your videos inspired me to start binge drinking. Thank you, man. <laughs> Happy to help a fan. Hey, what's something that's boring to do during the day, but fun to do at night? Blood sacrifices, I do one every week. One day, you'll be browsing in a store and pick the clothes you'll die in. Not if I die naked in an orgy. Yeah. One day you'll be browsing at a gay bar and pick the guy you'll die in, just as I intended. <laughs> I got a job at Comcast and completed training so I could fix my own cable because it was faster than being on hold with customer service. You know, I did the same but with abortions. Wait, Sebastian? Sebastian? Why would you- Hold on now. <laughs> Pause. What was your, they don't pay me enough for this crap, moment while at work? You know, one time while shooting for Brazzers for Kieran Lee, I had to dive into a pool and swim from one end to another while wearing a robe that weighed me down. I had to do many takes because of technical difficulties. Every time I held my breath and resurfaced, thought I was going to pass out. And then proceeded to get screwed in the butthole. Wow, that's something similar happened to me at work. Minus the swimming pool part. The robe and everything else was, you know, that happened, but not the swimming pool. What's your let that sink in fun fact? The inside of the male urethra is rifled, like the barrel of a gun, which causes urine to come out in a twisting motion which keeps flow straight instead of spraying out everywhere. So you're saying one can shoot a 007 intro through a penis? That's right. Talk about a golden gun. <laughs> when you know that there's a hair on your screen? Ah, 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 nice try. I have cancer. Out of the 7.7 .7 billion people on Earth, what do you think no one's doing right now? Contemplating how to kill me? Good. Blissfully unaware. Our plan is falling into place nicely, comrade. Hey, wait, what are you guys talking about, huh? Hey, wait a minute. <laughs> well, I don't like where this is going. How to talk to women. How to cope with rejection. Massive anime tits. You know, that massive anime tits doesn't look used enough at all. I had to get a new one. Last cup, he got too sticky. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> no thanks. When your double homicide case is handed over to four teenagers and a dog? Hey, wait, whoa, what are you doing here? I wouldn't want that horny Fred picking around my dead corpse. Oh, I would. Kids today are more emotionally prepared for a zombie apocalypse than for a family get-together. Yeah, but in a zombie apocalypse, no one will ask me if I'm dating a nice girl yet. They also won't ask why I buried an axe in my uncle's head. Anyway, how you guys doing? <laughs> you know, he's lucky sharks aren't herbivores. He'd be dead. Male ladybugs can spend up to four hours mating with a dead female before they realize something's not right. These are confusing times. Wait, they're not supposed to be dead? 
What are you doing screwing out with ladybugs, dude? Stick to your own species, bro. Hey, uh, you spelled frick? Hey, did you know the word flick kinda looks like frick? Indeed. Did you know the word duck sort of rhymes with frick? Not really. But did you know I'm addicted to snorting my dead wife's ashes? <clears throat> <laughs> Oops, you just killed someone. What's the most creative way to hide the body? Ever since I was a kid, I'd always thought that if I had to hide a body, then it'd be smart to keep it somewhat temporary. Then leave an anonymous tip to the police about it being in a certain place. They'd then dig that place up, realize it's not there, and move on. Then I'd bury the body in that place. The freshly dug soil won't be suspicious, and the police wouldn't look there because they already have. Trust me, this tactic works great. No one's found Damien yet. Hey, wait, what? What's going on? Wait, hold on. Whoa, wait, hey, whoa, wait, ho. Hey, hold on now. <laughs> my pubes are too long. <laughs> So's my wiener. Where's the scissors? Um, they're, in the, they're in the junk drawer. There are probably spots of floor inside your house that you've never stepped on. The day after I moved in, I dragged my wiener over every square. The day after I moved in, I dragged my wiener over every square into this house. Yo, why would you buy dog flavored ice cream? Nah, uh, uh it's ice flavored dog cream. Get it right. Oh my god, is that a little guy? Oh my god, look at you. You fit in a spoon. <laughs> Don't eat. What if they taste better than anything else on earth? Damn ethics getting in the way of my lunch yet again. No, look at him. He's a cute little guy. I'm gonna name him Henry. Oh. <laughs> University gym girl's bathroom has not only free condoms, but free lube. Oh, finally. A bathroom that offers snacks and drinks. Back up, because if you hit this car while my kids are in here, I'ma beat your butt until the police come. Hey yo, peel the B and B off. <laughs> mm, and then I wanna hit the car. Hey, uh, why is there a little 18 plus on the bottom left? Well, it could be used as a butt plug. Rocky, more like cocky. <laughs> Get it, cause like wiener? Yeah, I'm funny. Imagine being scared of a wholesome yellow bear. When he consumes honey like he consumes his enemies. With passion. Everyone's favorite drink, epilepsy. My brother loves this so much, he's dancing on the floor ecstatically. Dude, my grandpa's doing the same thing. We love epilepsy. <laughs> the boys when I pick up my mom's phone call. I'm gonna finish harder, daddy. Ah, uh, I'm not gonna moan on the microphone, so you're gonna get that. I'm not about, listen, I know how the internet works. If I moan on the microphone, I'm gonna see that on like 4chan somewhere. Where it's like, hey, listen, I put, I put the Reddit guy's moans to this pornography. You know, listen to this. <laughs> oh my god, it's so big. Yeah, you probably shouldn't pick up the phone if you're getting screwed by your friends then. What can I say? When mom calls, I gotta answer. DMs from girls are like, Hi Angel, so sorry to bother, but where did you get your top from? And DMs from guys are like, I wanna put a... I wanna put a McDonald's straw... <laughs> I've read this before, it kills me still. I wanna put a McDonald's straw in your butt and suck. I'll run through a scorching hot desert for a thousand miles barefoot with scorpions all over my body while eating 40 Popeye's biscuits with nothing to drink just to suck the fart out of your butt with your last huge straw. That's dedication. And to be fair, Maddie kind of popping. I can understand. <laughs> so bad. So dumb. My cream slash jelly filled donut didn't have any filling this morning. You could fill your own donut, dude. Mm -hmm -hmm. Yeah. Little Jason's first selfie. Make it his last. Dude, what the heck? That's my kid. That's no kid, that's a grown man. Would you punch a little kid for five million dollars? Oh, and he's knocked him out. Once I saw a kid being beaten up by four older guys down the street. Of course I went to help. He stood no chance against the five of us. <laughs> like the Avengers, but bullying some child. James French. Crime killed two people. Death, electric chair on August 10th, 1966. Last words. How's this for a headline? French fries. You know, I like my fries crunchy. Not burned. Almost empty Pringles can. Me. What in the sweet titty doing Christ are children doing these days? Preparing for their future careers, of course. Where was the weirdest place you masturbated? On top of my girlfriend. Then I was kicked out by her horrified parents. God. Way to ruin the funeral. Hey, wait, whoa, hold on, man. <laughs> you didn't tell me it was a funeral. Grab yourself a tissue box and watch Grave of the Fireflies. Dude, why are you jerking out the World War II dramas? No! What? Dude, no, no, no. Just a child starvation. God. <laughs> so bad. Oh my god, if baby oil dissolves his condoms, what the hell does it do to babies? You know, this may be shocking, but babies and condoms are made of different material. It's like rock, paper, scissors. Baby oil defeats condom. Baby defeats baby oil, and condom defeats baby. But what beats all three? Ah, glad you asked. 
Microwaves. When you close your eyes, you see the loading screen tips for the situation you're in. Oh god, I just want to sleep. Stop giving me tips about how to hide a body. Why ask for a roast when you can't handle the heat? You know, I matched with a girl who had hate people who take everything too seriously always up for a laugh in a bio. I had, I could fit two fingers and one nostril in mine. She messaged me saying, that's an impressive nostril you have. To which I replied, thanks. You should see my butthole. <laughs> And I was promptly unmatched. I think she may have taken me seriously. That's a great response. What are you talking about? That's genius. That's hilarious. The bleeding tree. Plot twist. It's a hollow log and a homeless man slept in it overnight. Sometimes that's nature, dude. My cat died today. I'm so sad. My pillow smells like him. Oh, it's gonna be okay. Hey, uh, send me his corpse. I'm horny. Hey, whoa, dude, hey. Someone's dead kitty cat, you can't do that. This man got his college degree hours before his death. And at least he doesn't need to pay his student loans anymore. Always look at the bright side. I used to be a glass blower and still occasionally do it as a hobby. My grandson asked me to make him a special vase for his Christmas and he gave me a picture of a bomb. The idiot thinks I don't know what it is, so I'll make him a huge glass wiener instead. <laughs> he can still smoke out of it though. When you get too high and start overthinking everything. Oh, finally. Some good jack-off material. Hey, well, don't do that to the per- He's just trying to help you make hamburgers, dude. He's hamburger helper. Are you cutting eye holes into that pumpkin? Uh, um, yeah. Eye holes, uh, that's what those are. Nah, these are jack-off lanterns. Ejacu lantern? Nah, dude, it's jacked in a lantern. Thanks for your contributions, Reddit. If you had to beat the devil in one competition for your soul, what would you challenge him in? You know, I'd have a hand job competition. I would bet that I could jerk myself off better than he could jerk me off. I'm either gonna win, or I'm gonna receive a hand job that is so good that it's gonna be worth my soul. 200 IQ play, dude. If the government finds oil in your backyard, then it's their property. But if you find drugs, then it's yours? Hey, what about the kids that are buried in my garden? Mine are the government's. Ask it for a friend. Nothing gets through this armor. <laughs> yeah? Keanu Reeves is likely to die in your lifetime if you're under 20. <sighs> Why, would you... Why would you say that? Uh, no, uh, not if I kill myself first. And now to feature a post from Chris DePula. Hello, I'm an art student slash character designer from the Philippines. Here's a fan art for the boy Damien. I turned him into a badass demon. Hey! I just wanted to say thank you, because your videos are the ones that keep me alive when I'm stressed out from schoolwork so whenever I'm down. Oh, you're welcome. Uh, oh! Yo, this is sick. I'd be a hot demon. Now I wish I looked like this in real life. That is sick. That is super cool. Yeah, we've, we've included your, uh, your Facebook page. Go follow this guy. That's talent. That's mad talent. Chris Dapula, thank you so much. You're a legend. And that brings us to the end of r slash curse comments. If you liked the video, leave a like down below and subscribe for more content from MK. And as always, I'll be seeing you.